In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix cursor not moving on Mac. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you are having trouble using your cursor on a Mac, either through a trackpad or an external mouse, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to fix this. So first, I'm going to start with the simplest fix possible that works for most people. All that you have to do, first of all, is to force shut down your Mac. Now, this is going to be by far the best option available. It is easy to do, and as soon as you restart, your cursor should appear again and it should start working. But of course, if you have some work that you still need to save and you can't afford to lose it, then you can try other options beforehand. But like I said, this one is going to be by far the best option available. Now, if you don't want to shut down your Mac or if it still doesn't work, the next thing that I would recommend is to actually plug it into a power adapter. So if it isn't plugged in, try doing this. As weird as this may seem, it is something that Apple actually recommends if your trackpad or your cursor is not working. So plug it into a power outlet and then see if this works. If it does, then it should be able to retain the cursor even after you take it off from the power outlet. It just needs to charge for a while. Usually, if your MacBook is running low on battery, it can actually trigger weird stuff like this. So make sure that it is sufficiently charged or keep it plugged into a power outlet to see the cursor. Now, if both of these solutions do not work, what you can try to do is to go over to the accessibility options, access the pointer control category, and then enable or disable mouse keys. Usually, this option needs to be disabled. Of course, this is going to be difficult to do because if your trackpad is not working, it is going to be hard to get here. But you can try connecting an external mouse temporarily or use your keyboard to access the, these options. And once you go here, make sure that this option is disabled. Besides this, there is not much else that you can do. Make sure that your trackpad is clean. Make sure that it doesn't have any dust or debris. And make sure that you are using only one finger to slide across the trackpad. If you are using multiple fingers at once, usually this can cause issues. And as long as you clean it thoroughly, you will be able to use your cursor on any MacBook. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix cursor not moving on Mac. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.